I'm Ray Reynolds, I'm the founder of Your Board. It's a hybrid electric scooter skateboard um, that I've developed over the last six years using SolidWorks. The idea came from developing an, a, a kid's stunt scooter to have more uh, ability to do skills and tricks and flips and over seven prototypes it's developed into a commuter vehicle that rides like a snowboard. So I'm a snowboard instructor, I was a snowboard instructor in New Zealand and it was really to recreate that style of riding where you can carve and be able to do that when you can't get to the slopes on the streets. The ride style and the enjoyment that you get from the products we see is completely different. So instead of being standing straight on, with two hands on the handlebar, we ride side on and you lean to steer. So it's a completely different riding experience. You can take it off road, whereas most normal e-scooters are just placed uh, on the road. And it's, yeah, so it's designed to be both a practical commuter vehicle and for something to have fun at weekends with your friends. Yeah, well, it was essential really to, to package the product, to know the shape and design of the deck. Uh, in order that it's not going to you're not going to get wheel bite when you turn corners and the trucks turn, basically look at the, the visual uh, aspect of the board and, and make it look like a, a cool product, a nice product, without being able to do that in 3D CAD. It's a lot more difficult, uh, impossible probably, and we'd go through a lot more prototypes. So yeah, it was essential to to, to get everything together and and come up with the product how it looks. The Entrepreneur Programme has been fantastic for us. We, there's no way we could uh, afford a full licence uh, without paying customers, without validating our product. So it's allowed us to, to develop the first level of products, which we were then able to put out to the market to see with, that we had validation. And even before manufacturing the full product, we were able to use the package to make renders, photorealistic renders through Visualize to, to display what we thought the product was going to look like to gauge interest without the ability to do that, we, we, wouldn't have, we wouldn't have been able to commit to the next stages and put money towards things because we had the validation and the, and the confidence that we had a good product. Certainly Visualize, I didn't have access to. Um, so that's been, been allowed me to make photorealistic renders. And even before the product was even made, the first prototype, I was able to see what it looked like and, and show people what it looked like. It's not easy, no. I, and yeah, I, I, I had to work another job for the majority of it. I've only just gone full time onto this uh, about three months ago. So juggling the two is, is difficult, but yeah, and you go through hard times and stressful times and work long weekends, but if it's in you, I think it's in you and you just have to do it and, and go through the, the hard work and it's ultimately it will be worth it.